again back to my channel my name is Andrea for those that do know me hello welcome to my channel please don't forget to subscribe because I will have a lot of exciting things coming up but anyways today I have a big 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 Sephora VIV rich haul um I honestly never thought I would have such a big haul but I think I did some did do some bad damage for my bank account but anyways um, I'm just putting this video up for those that have not shopped in store just kind of get an idea what you could shop for or for the BIV sale that's coming up on November 11 and yeah so let me go show you I have like literally two humongous bags full of stuff um, imagine carrying this for two hours it's crazy this store itself was crazy there was so much people it was so hard to walk and people came asking me you need another basket I had like three baskets like hello I only have two hands how am I gonna carry more items you know but it when I was able to get everything I wanted my hand is swollen I feel because of so much weight I put into it but I'm happy and yeah so let's get right into this hopefully this video is not over 15 minutes because I don't want it to be that long but yeah let's go ahead right into it so I did do a uh, purchase in Sephora and say JCPenney first because in my mall there's one Sephora inside JCPenney and then there's just a regular standalone Sephora and I picked this ad up. This was I believe, I don't know if it's new or old, it's the Sephora favorites fall most wanted. It includes five items, deluxe sizes and it retails for $30 but I pay, um, it got reduced to $15 plus my discount I only pay $12. I was so excited that I picked this up guys and just to let you know this is all my Sephora VIV root sale um, haul I will not be purchasing anything else so this is it guys no more and I also picked up this baby up here this is um, amazing guys I play with it in store I was so happy I was able to have have it in my hands because I I loved it like literally I, I will have a review on this but yeah I picked that up now on the Sephora one obviously the big one that's where I did the most damage so let's start I'll just start randomly um, I picked up the Sephora favorites a ready set style and this is just basically a hairspray collection it's dry shampoo hairspray and yeah and then they have like the dry spoon finish um, they're basically for your hair uh, sprays for your hair and this is $29 obviously once again I'm telling you the value of the actual things I'm not telling you the discount price but you know I did get 20% on everything so yeah I picked this one up and then also another hair product I picked this set up it's called Sephora Favorites Hair Rescue Mask on the Go these are basically hair masks and they're I guess they look sizes but this was was only $25 then um I think this is a time for me to stock up on skincare because we're transitioning from summer to fall and winter so I think your skin needs a lot of nutrients back and this is a time for you to get um get items get items at a cheaper price um skincare so yeah so just letting you guys know that okay I will have be having a lot of skincare so I picked this new set up, it's the 3 step egg essential and this is what it looks like. It contains a full size of the moisturizer and a full uh, a deluxe size facial cleanser, a sponge and a mask. So this was $39 and I never tried this brand but I'm glad to try it because I tried the moisturizer in the store and it was so soft so yeah. I also had to pick up two sets of the new... Bosia, is that how you say Bosia? I'm not sure how you say it, but I picked this set up, guys. This is what it looks like, and it basically contains Japanese favorites, and it contains an exfoliating peel gel, detoxifying black cleanser, an instant luminizer mo moisturizer, a brightening peel off mask. So basically, I feel for $35, guys, um, you get such great amount, and especially I heard a lot of good reviews on this brand, so I'm happy to try it. I also picked up the other set, and this set it's called the Bosia uh, Balance to Perf Perfection. So this is basically to minimize your pores, and this is what it looks like, guys. It comes with a full size detoxifying black cleanser, a white charcoal mattifying makeup setting spray, luminizing black mask, and a Riva uh, black hydrating gel. 
so yeah so that's what I picked up from there oh and from because I shopped more than $50 and Sephora inside JCPenney I got these two freebies um for free it's a Burberry black perfume and a little sample and then I also got the low I don't know how to say but this hand cream so yeah and of course I got two of these holiday uh, tote bag that they give you. I got two, one in Sephora inside JCPenney and one in the regular Sephora. Then I also picked up two mask sets. Um, I love masks, so I picked up this one up and this one. The difference between one, this is the Sephora collection of face masks. So this is $25. It includes six full size of face masks. And yeah, and basically... I never tried them so I'm excited but I love face masks so I thought $25 plus my 20% off it's a good deal so I also picked up the other set and the other set it's called mask it all over set and basically this is basically um mask for your hands feet eyes face um yeah so you basically get a variety in there and it was also $25 discounted obviously I'm not gonna say Obviously, it was discounted because you guys do know that the VIV retail, you get 20% off. So, yeah. I also got this set from Mura. It's the Party Perfect. And never try this moisturizer because this is hella expensive. Like, really, really expensive, guys. Um, it, it wasn't because I read the reviews and I tried it in the store. And because I justified that I was getting the 20% off, I'll, I would have never gotten it. Because $65 for a moisturizer... It's quite pricey. Obviously, this is a value pack. So just alone, the moisturizer, so it's a 1.7 fluid ounce. It's um, 65 alone. So you do get in you do you do get a pair of iPads, a Murat firming eye lift treatment, and a ultimate uh, moisturizer. So this was 65 with the 98 dollar value. And I like I said, I wasn't planning to get it, but when I try the moisturizer, the Visiblur. A moisturizer in store it felt amazing guys it felt so smooth it felt like almost like a primer and then it's gonna give me SPF 30 and it's gonna protect it felt kind of like it was a primer because it kind of mattified me and I saw that my pores kind of disappear and it has 30 30 percent 30 SPF so yeah another skincare item and probably that's the last oh my god I got so much freaking skincare plus I you guys do know my other reviews from the Soka to Tokyo and the Sephora Scout it what am I gonna do with so much skincare I also picked up the Sephora's um skin wonderland and this was $64 and it has an $156 value you get so much in here guys this was so heavy it's literally really heavy and I already kind of opened mine so you guys could see what's in here. So let me show that up close. And yeah. And this is all you get in here. Ooh, I already saw something falling. So you get a lot, guys. I'm not going to go and review. If you guys want to see a review of anything that I am mentioning, please post it in the comments down below. And I'll be happy to do the review for you guys. But I was excited most and for all to try this item. And this is a SK SK number two uh, facial treatment. And if you guys do know, this is super expensive. Like super, super expensive. I think the full size is like a hundred and something dollars. So this is this little bottle is forty dollars. If you divide it into ounces, this is forty dollars. I paid for the box like fifty dollars. So obviously I was gonna get. It. So yeah. So that was it from skincare. Now going on to um, makeup products. I have a lot of makeup products. Not a lot, but some. So okay, my makeup products was a Kat Von D metal palette. So I already talked about that because that one I bought at JC Penney. I also got the Becca. Shimmy Skin Perfector and Quartz, Rose Quartz. This, I thought I wasn't going to be able to get it because I had no hope for it. I was like, this is sold out, most likely. And you guys do know how this looks. It's like a um, rose gold pink. And look inside. is oh my god. The packaging feels so pretty, so luxurious. Like, I love it. I love it. And this is probably the most expensive, I want to say, highlighter, or shimmering block or whatever that I have ever bought because I usually get like, you know, like deals like where you get more for your money and just for me to spend almost like over $30 just for this item was because I really, really, really wanted it and I really like how I swatched. But yeah, I was 
happy that I was able to pick that up. I also picked up the Malta Matte Limited Edition um, from Too Faced, the Peppermint Mocha. And this comes like a kind of like a fuchsia color. I really like the smell of it. So I got that. I also got the Naked Skin Urban Decay Color Corrective Fluid in the color pink. And this is just basically an eye corrector or a face corrector and to brighten out your face. And I, this is quite pricey too. It's $28. So I was like, the only way to get it is discount it. So this was the time lag. Then I also found the Huda Beauty Lip Contour Set um, at my local Sephora. And it comes with two little mini Huda lipsticks as well as a full size eyeliner. For, this was $24 guys so I picked this up it's a beautiful color I got it in the color uh, trophy wife and muse um let me talk about the Huda Beauty palette a little bit it was in stock in my store and honestly that was the first thing I wanted to buy from the sale the Huda Beauty palette but when I, I play it took me about an hour to play around with it in store that's why it took so long in store not because of this this all of this I already knew that I wanted but the Huda Beauty palette took me an hour to play with it in store. I, I didn't want to buy it and do a review and then just go return it. I obviously wanted to be honest. Like, Andrea, are you really buying it because you want it, not just because you're trying to make a review? And I was playing with it and I was like, oh, okay, Andrea, do you want to buy it because you like it? And you're going to be able to make a review or do you just want to buy it to, to prove that it's not worth it? So I played around with it and yeah, they were beautiful colors. They look beautifully. The packaging was really flimsy, like everyone has, has said. For such a price tag, it is a very not professional packaging. And the quality, honestly, I'm so sorry. I love Huda. Huda, she's, she's an amazing person, like literally amazing. But I really didn't like the quality. The quality is really bad, guys. It wasn't it, the the like texture eyeshadows look weird, and then they kind of had like this um. Like, I don't know, it was weird and they weren't having a lot of color payoff and just wasn't on my, like, I wasn't like, oh, it's worth spending that much money there. So, I just had to pass, like, pass on it. If you guys have it and you love it, then I'm so happy that you guys were able to work with it. I wasn't able to work with it somehow. I, like I said, I tried it in store. Um, I even took my own brush in store and just kind of swiped there on my hand and it wasn't working with a brush obviously the texture eyeshadows had to be applied with your finger but then I tried it with my fingers too finger swatch and nothing was working so I really didn't like that so I had to pass on to that but anyways I also picked up the master palette master palette by Marion from the Anastasia I am so happy this was in stock I am not uh, I really don't like warm tone palettes but I felt that it was a good quality palette and maybe in the fall and the winter I could get well it's well in winter maybe in the winter I could get a use out of this so yeah last but not least I picked up these uh house of lashes set and this is so cute guys this is what it comes in it basically comes with a pair of eyelashes a lash um, glue two lash glues and a set and this was only $24 so yeah so so happy to find that in store Last but not least, I was able to pick up the NARS. I'm sorry, I just heard a sound. <laughs> so paranoid. I, I was able to pick up the last guy, the last NARS um, Serum Moon um, lipstick set. You guys know that this got sold out today so quick and I had no hopes for it. I had been wanting to buy it and I couldn't believe that I got it for 20% off and it was the last one, guys. Like the last one. And right after I picked it up, I heard someone saying, do you guys happen to have the uh, lip the the lip glide set in stock? Oh no, we're, we're probably sold out. And I was like, yeah, I took the last one. But yeah, that was it for my Sephora haul. That was a lot guys and i'm sorry this video was like almost 15 minutes long but don't forget to like this video don't forget um to leave me if you guys want any reviews on any of the sets i just talked about and i hope you guys have a wonderful sh shopping time and like i said if you guys know that you're not going to use something don't buy it because of the 20 percent. if you are going to use something obviously take advantage because support never gives 20 percent off so thank you guys so much for watching and i'll talk to you